What couch cushion? The couch cushion you said you would send me. Ah, oh, you don't pay enough money. My face looks fresh. <laughs> uh, right now I'm using um, a mixture of creams. No, you can't have it for free. I haven't been to the cinema in a long time because we just watch the movies here. You know? Like, I don't know. The cinema is just, I don't know. Except for the nachos there. <laughs> like we can make you do anything. I told her that she didn't need to worry about her real life. I don't freaking idiots. Like what? what is the complaint about? Not another big person complaining about what I'm eating, right? I hope not, but probably. Nachos, yum, I'm hungry. Worried about your weight and not living alone. Like, why? Like, F off. I thought I was vile. Why are people like, you know what I mean? Like, get a life. Tracy, she's fat. That's what fucking pisses me off about these idiots. Every single fat ass person on the internet is coming for me about my weight and what I eat. Like, worry about your own calories. Like, I don't get it. It's so stupid. I can't. Like, I'm, I'm down in weight. I'm down in inches. My blood sugars are, like, fine. Like, people are stupid. Like, worry about your own life. The, the level of obsession these people have with me is not sane, okay? Not sane. I'm just telling you. That's it. That's all you gotta know. You need medication. You need help. People think that it's, like, you're good. Like, do you know how long it took me to put on this weight? It's gonna take a long time to take it off, okay? Like, worry about your own methods and whatever. Like, I've said a million times... I'm not depriving myself. I'm not cutting out food groups. I'm not going to uh, completely eliminate. You know what I mean? Like eating a pita pizza is a hell of a lot better than eating a whole large pizza from Domino's. If you can't see those little changes, I don't give a shit. But leave my friggin' mods alone. Leave my people alone. They worry about their own life. That's why they're decent people. They're not psychotic. Like F off. I didn't even see. I don't, I don't care. I'm not going to pay attention to them or look at their shit. Like I can't. Like <laughs> I don't care. What, it's, it's the hypocrisy in Gore World that makes me pissed off. It's so weird i've never in my life had so many parasites stuck up my ass like i don't get it like it's it's odd yeah sure late girl mm -hmm. yeah that would ever happen considering i would rather die than ever be face to face with that swordfish ever again in my life never gonna happen every reactor has more skeleton exactly bell i don't know but it's it's insane like get a life oh People can be crazy sometimes, right, ECP? Sorry to interrupt your rage. <laughs> um, we're gonna watch a movie soon, that's why I'm going live. <laughs> right, Neil? I mean, come on, anyone with a brain. Anyone with a brain. That's the, the difference between Beezers and zombies. Beezers have brains. Beezers have, should I make merch and put that on a t-shirt? Beezers have brains. <laughs> <sighs> the bakery in Wafra was a food bank. <laughs> Shut up! Yeah, it's a food bank. You're right. Like, it's literally... <laughs> it's a pie. It's a bakery. Like, what? Is there a food bank bakery that you know of anywhere? Him calling me a creature? Have you seen him? He looks like literally a zombie, a corpse. He looks like he's buried in the pyramid somewhere and they need to uncover his body with an archaeological dig. Uh, it doesn't hurt my feelings, trust me. <laughs> I cracked out at 4 a.m. every day talking. There's still talking about us <laughs> what the frick babe did you hear that if you're watching i don't know the crypt keeper yeah. <laughs> exactly remember how the crypt keeper talked <laughs> i'm coming to wipe your ass annie nina bachelor we have dog killers calling you a bad pen when we have pdf file defenders calling you one we have cameraless voices talking about your look sad nina i'm telling you when i say beezers have brains you do yeah jason i did see 100k plaque the last time Boozin was on camera was to show Isaac guess her beef and champ. Oh, I wasn't thinking about that when I read it. Okay, by the way, Julia is out of heat. So, well, mostly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she is. So, we scheduled for the next available appointment, which, thank goodness, is not far down the line. Sunday. She will be spayed. Oh, yeah. You can't get lettuce here. And prove it, loser. <laughs> If that's the case, then you're smoking uh, illegal. It's obvious. If you're reacting to someone's behavior, you shouldn't have to cam up. 
If you're going for looks, it's cowardly not to. Yeah, exactly. If you're like, you know, yeah, exactly. Except if you're going to compare yourself and say, well, I'm going to do a diet and I'm doing really awesome. You don't show yourself. What the hell? People are stupid to just believe that. Now everyone can find something else to talk about. Anyway, aren't they? Their channels, they're ban evading. So I would shut up if I were you. I can't move the basket because she likes to sleep on it. So don't mind the basket and the vacuum. I, was vacu I got to still vacuum in this area. So that's why I put the vacuum in the room I have left to do. I guess being uh, horn horn makes her tired tired. Yeah, Lois, obviously. That's what. That's why the internet is like, you know, you can just say what you want. I think if I ever go back to Canada, even for a visit, maybe I'll buy another Kia and keep it there. <laughs> I know people I can park at where I parked my Kia the other time. I got some hookups. I got some parking hookups. Please absolutely discuss and suggest that Salah would do that to animals. Jennifer is a disgusting woman who neglects her by ritual order. Mm. Yeah, we don't give a crap what comes out of her friggin' maw. Do you talk about politics? Not really, Jason. I kind of talk about everything, but I just don't pay attention enough to politics. Why did you sell the OG one? <laughs> I don't know. It's old. I mean, I'm not going to be probably going back for a while anyway. Even to visit, you know? <sighs> What's on the menu? I'm not eating anything right now. I'm done eating. We ordered our dinner. I'm not going to tell you what it was because you're just going to, it's just going to be content for haters and they're going to mess, they're going to be all over Twitter talking about what I ate. They're going to be counting the calories. They're going to be messaging my mods. No. No, thanks. <laughs> I'm just here to bees for a while. Not a long time. Counting every grain of rice. Well, love. I hope you didn't eat so long. That <laughs> he's cute enough. He's he's hot enough to eat, but no, I'd miss him. Oh, okay, tattoo beauty. Which child did I talk about, loser? Threaten me? You think I'm scared of anybody? If somebody threatened to come to my home to Canada with, but they probably have a criminal record and can't cross the border. I'm waiting. My address is probably out there. Come to my house. Come. I'll wipe my ass with you. Oh. Oh, you stink. <laughs> oh. Talking about parenting when it's put online, you know, versus mentioning the na someone's kid by name, talking about them, it's very different. I really don't know how much of a tard you have to be to realize that, but you're really clearly not grasping it. Just like people comment on my cat parenting, Fair game. Fair game. Sorry. People do it to me all the time, YouTube lover. People abortion shame. People call, like dissect every little thing about my pet ownership and call me a bad pe a pet owner. So if you do that to me and you put your information out there, like there's tons of live streams and videos of your kid being kicked or by, you know, and the person going to jail, I have a right to talk about that. 100% go cry in a corner no one cares you're trash <laughs> the biggest hypocrites I can't even like I can't don't listen to dumb people yeah sit <laughs> cry in a corner and sit and spin she and his fact an actual child it's a fact and there are plenty of receipts and documentation exactly if people want to support that go for it you look hella dumb but there's people who are so like they get so like eager and like oh somebody else is hating on on foodie beauty we're going to encourage that talk to yourselves no one gives a shit it's actually insane who they flock to just to spread more hatred. Exactly. You know, like they get so excited. You could just see like, let's go. Yeah. Like tear her a new one kind of thing. Like get a life. Julia curled up const constantly next to you. Must be a bad parent. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> what was the tipping point for her to turn on you? Um, she came for me in a passive aggressive community um, about my cat, like about my cat. And people came in the chat and were like, you know, she wrote this about you, blah, blah, blah. And I was just like, really, you know? And I always was just like, met them to keep the peace. I don't know. I was just like, whatever. They, I, I wasn't friends with them. You saw in the messages I posted, like, I never, like, I barely responded to them on Cameo, maybe a couple of times, a lot of the time unanswered. And then, you know, I always secretly thought they were like pieces of, like, they were weird, like always preaching about things. Like, like in a, you know, like TV evangelists, the crazy, like, <clears throat> zealous people that like, in the name of Jesus. Like that, he was like total Otis psycho. And like, 
I comment on like, you're not going to talk about me. I wouldn't talk about anyone's painting, like pets or not. Like if you see somebody went through their house, her litter box was like covered, covered in shit. Like not just a few turds, which is bad to leave a, even a few turds, okay? Happens full of shit. It was leaking out of the box. That's, that's neglect. That's disgusting. Her crypt keeper looking friggin' douchebag of a boyfriend um, was arrested and served time because he, her son, and she has the nerve to be like, I'm a mama bear. You're a bear, but you ain't no mama. Disgusting humans. So I was saying like, you're worse than me. Why are you making passive aggressive, sanctimonious friggin' posts about um, trying to educate anybody on cat care? You know, calling herself a cat expert. I was like, excuse me, ma'am, did you see the litter box? <laughs> yeah, real, real. That's like, there's literal receipts of like, that's evidence. It's, that was on the internet. That's not me pulling it out of my big app, you know? So I mentioned that in return for her post about me. And uh, of course, like every other person, they go and make reactions about me. They go and talk about things that makes them look like a big fat hypocrite. Um, you know, and now they're, yeah, they're using for views. Exactly. Yeah. They're taking advantage of the, the hate audience I have, which are stupid idiots, just like them, willing to excuse child abuse and blatant hypocrisy of somebody who is literally like 600 pounds get on a scale and prove it that you're not can't even walk to a store can't walk to the when i walk to the cafe could they do that could she do that no and she sits there on her fat high horse talking about my diet cycle are you kidding me what she was found in bed with a year old really i never heard about that that's what i'm saying people act like they were i was bffs with them no <laughs> you know <laughs> That's like the only time I ever talked to them off the app was on Cameo and they paid for it. So if you pay me, I'll be nice to you <laughs> for five minutes. I'm just kidding. Except for you guys. I love you guys. <laughs> Wipe my arse. <laughs> Anyways, I'm not talking about them. Like, I don't want to talk about them because every time I do, it's just like attention and money for them. You know, forget it. I don't want to promote these really sad, vile criminals. She thinks she's gonna become famous. Yeah, I know. She sits there like I saw in your mama. She thinks she's all like a professional, you know? <clears throat> yeah, exactly. Storm. It's not worth it. That's what like I don't I don't even know why people care. No one cares what they say exactly. Just like the swordfish, you know. I don't know how much like how long they're gonna have to talk about us to realize that nobody cares about you. Like, people don't like you. I'm way too nice to people. Kind of, like, yeah, sort of, but uh no, Dan. I'm fine with what I have. I have plenty of money. Thank you. <clears throat> Actually, I'm fixing. <laughs> Tracy says, I'm fixing to go shopping tomorrow. I need a new mascara. I might go to Sephora. And they, I want to try, they, they have on sale the better than SEX mascara, but because we're in an Islamic country and that's inappropriate, they call it better than love mascara. <laughs> yeah, I have no, M60, I have no interest in entertaining it anymore, honestly, even in live streams, like, no, I just want a bees. Yeah, I know. The kids' beds were like this color. <laughs> you ever hear of washing sheets by any chance? And people bring up like, you know, my health or the state of my house, like from back in the villa. Like how many years ago was that? Right. I saw a video yesterday about most disturbing YouTube channels and Jenny was mentioned. They're ban evading. Like, I hope their channels get removed. Yeah, my kitchen. But, like, that's not, like, normal. Like, that's, like, from the day before. Like, I didn't bother doing up the dishes or whatever, you know? It's not like that all the time. And the rest of my house is not a pigsty. And also, my litter box is never full of crap. Ever. Who cares about that trash? Yeah, exactly. The only reason, again, the only reason, like, they probably think, oh, look, we got clout, we got you know, attention because I have like so many haters, right? So the, the thing that's ironic is people are willing to hate me, but will excuse people like this. Like, I don't get it. Just so that, you know what I mean? So they'll, they'll be like, oh, we have clout, we have clout. But the only reason people care is because you're hating on me. Nobody gives a shit about you and they don't actually like you. The only thing, like you have mutual um, hate. That's exactly with reaction channels as well. Because if you look at somebody like Trashy Yabba, you know, um, if she makes videos about anything else, 3k views, meh. So mutual hate gets you views, gets you money. That's it. And it's not a secret. <sighs> I don't know why. I don't know what's with the settings on YouTube these days, but I can't fix it. I tried. 
It's a sign of judgment, day sis, when the good people will be seen as bad or wrong and the bad people will be seen as good. Yeah, you know what? And they usually are. Like, I always say that, but, like, even Hitler had fans. You know? Like, everybody is, like, I don't know. But, yeah, you're right, Sarah Jean. It could be. Watch her bump. I know Apple 8 because they're all brain dead like her. And just to hate on me. It's, like, it, it gives them life. It's really sad and weird. <laughs> Here come 12 videos about you mentioning Hitler. Yeah, exactly. They're, I'm going to be called a Nazi, Jonah Fork. Anyone with self-awareness can understand that regardless of what religion you're a part of, judging others is not going to advance anyone's way in the pearly gates. <laughs> yeah, true. Lately, I find it to be a chore. I look so tired, though, like, if I don't put makeup on, like, right now. No, it's not against TOS, unfortunately. How are you going to hit on this calm conversation? <laughs> yeah, I know. Any plans for the weekend? Yes mostly content plans like you know i'm probably gonna go shopping tomorrow and then we're probably gonna do like the farms and stuff i don't know what we're gonna do exactly but i'm tired i need to get the eye drops the fashion show i don't think i'm gonna buy clothes but <laughs> don't forget hey justine i'm gonna probably do a video don't forget a lot of the clothes i wear you don't see because it's not modest so when I'm at home, I don't wear any uncomfortable long sleeve, long pants. Nah, I'm wearing like, I can't say, but <laughs> you know, no thanks. Oh, I'm so tired, guys. Different when you're on screen. If you were with all women, we could see your hair. Yeah, if there were nobody else watching. But we haven't been sleeping the best because of Julia being in heat. So that's why I'm extra tired. <laughs> Um, I did trim my hair for the summer, so it's like to hair to. It seems a bit shinier and like a bit fuller. Like, I don't know if it's like the vitamins I'm taking. They have like a lot of biotin in them. And also I've been taking a lot of vitamin D. And when I remember, I add collagen to my Nescafe. It'll grow faster now that your diabetes is under control. Yeah, actually, you're right, because I remember like, um, I can't remember who said that, but you're right. Like it r rings a bell that. When you get your like blood sugars under control it's like yeah i know what you mean but it's like also hormonal but public, the public restrooms a lot of them are he here are very like clean so i don't like to use them but they're cl usually clean here and they have bidets cool it looks clean there's a lot of places yeah most places are like especially you know public places but there's some areas that are not but it's like every country you know every country has dumpy areas <laughs> pcos i didn't have pcos but well, they never said I did, but I'm sure I had something like that, like, you know, symptoms of that. I get like a few chin hairs, but that's like new in the, the recent years. Probably from being old. <laughs> <laughs> Baba, I don't do anything with other people in mind on my channel. I didn't have Amberlynn in mind at all when I was doing that. But you know who is a piece of crap? Um, Mr. Snowfake for posting a song, a crappy AI song, I'm sure about um the cat gone missing like making a like how would you say it a very jaunty happy jingle about rarity going missing you're an awesome person you're literally a piece of crap <laughs> trying to connect haters trying to connect non non-existent dots that's what they always do it is distasteful go go give him shit because he posted a whole song Make, I think it's like Under the Hood, a channel. I saw DC post it. That's the only reason I know. A DC media girl. Condemning it, which rightfully so. Anyone with a mature brain would see that. Yeah, he parades around like the moral police. Yeah. He made a whole song, a diss track, about her cat going missing. Like, you people are disgusting. And I think you like that. I think you get a kick out of me saying that to you. What does a 3D printer do? Does it bring food, like, into life? <laughs> Has anyone ever looked into his life? No idea distasteful jaunts a jaunty jingle he also said that rarity was probably dead the day amber posted that she was missing and to me that was terrible like that's the worst possible outcome i know they talk about it like there's no you know human and animal involved it's just they're just gross like i don't know that's so sick haha you made that stupid joke yesterday kevin and no one laughed who <laughs> could print real food could you imagine would end world hunger Storm, he has sent scandalous pictures to fans on Discord. Ew. A biatch male. 
and gore world drama making fun of a missing cat. How attractive. It's like the friggin' tree ladies. So sick. They have no empathy, none. No matter what someone thinks of Amber. And she didn't do it on purpose. Get a life. Not funny at all. All the men in Goal World are gross. Yeah, majority. It's sad. Yeah, it is Justine. Yeah, of course you look bigger when you sit down. <laughs> like, duh. Especially if you're scrunched up like when I was stuck in that wheel. <laughs> or sitting hunchback on the side. Yeah. Jordy and Alex can kick rocks. They're horrid. They're so bitchy. Ugh. I can't. He's so basic and generic. I don't understand when people say he's so funny. Because the people who have that sense of humor are... They're probably like edgelord friggin', you know, 19, 20 year olds. Um, just dumbass people. I don't know what to say. <laughs> like, I don't know, Storm. He probably thinks it's his signature thing. That scream name. <laughs> Which one? Yours is funny, Jonah Fork. <sighs> yeah, Melanie, the same thing over and over. I know. I wouldn't want to waste my time watching that crap, but that's just me. Yeah, the self-righteousness drives me nuts, YouTube lover. Can you get Krispy Kreme? Yeah, I had some for um, um, for Halloween. Krispy Kremes are really good. Donuts. I like the smell of donuts. Like fresh ones. I kind of miss Tim Hortons for that. You're just someone living their life without hurting others. Thank you, Katie. I mean, I have said hurtful things back to haters, but I don't know. I feel like they deserved it. Maybe I'll change my mind about that someday, but that time is not now. Like I said, I know. Why can't donuts be good for you like kale, right? I don't even know who that is. Probably an obsessed weirdo, psycho, friggin' dumb ass bitch, just like everyone else. If someone pushes you enough to say something bad, they do deserve. Yeah, I think so. Like, I'm sorry. I I'm sure nobody here could ever handle without saying a peep anything to anybody with the amount of people coming after you. Life is too short to follow all the rules. Exactly. It's not like only what you eat. It's also how much you eat too. Oh yeah. Yeah, I know. I don't like having dirty bedding. That's one thing that mm -mm. drives me because you sleep in it, you know? Yeah. It's like public washroom for me. The ick. No. If you hear, hear me doing laundry, it's mostly my, always my bedding or, you know. I need to, need to do a bees outside the house one of these days. Really? What 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 happened with the raiding? And who is Nick Fuentes? I don't know who that is. Like, what happened to his stream? It was lame and short-lived and also a Neo. I'm sure. Why is a neo-Nazi going after Pete's? I don't even know who that is. <laughs> or probably somewhere like on an app where they don't allow hate like that. Although YouTube does allow hate, that's for sure. Only in Gore World. Apparently a neo-Nazi went after Pete's. I don't know. <laughs> I never know what's going on. Knowing him, he probably just went, meh. <laughs> Everyone's going to have differing opinions. Not everyone's going to like everybody that you like. Or, you know, <laughs> like, it's just not how it's going to be. No, apparently if I move to the right, my eyes become the same size. See? Yeah, I've had my thyroid checks. I've had a lot of blood work done. I haven't been to a club in, like, years. I, got, I can't even remember what happened the last time I went to a club. There's always something. It always smells like farts and beer in clubs. I hate them. Ugh. Like everyone's farting. Everyone has beer farts. I don't miss clubbing days. I hated going. Even though like I convinced myself to love it because it was like what people, everyone was doing. But now in retrospect, I hate it. I used to go with him to clubs, but no, the last time I went, I think it was like Shannon's bachelorette party. I think that's how long ago it was. <laughs> no, she's not Angela. She's getting spayed on Sunday. My couch looks so brown with the lights off and so much whiter. Like the light shining on this one is really white. This one looks really brown. The fuck? Take us on a shopping spree? I might do a vlog, Jonah Fork. I don't know if I'll go live. You know what I'm really craving? Oh, I have a recipe planned for this coming 
I did a, I planned, it took me like two hours just to plan a week of content. Like, and, and it's probably not even going to show, but like just planning what ideas, like the outings we're going to do, or I'm going to do also for my channel. So I planned like, not like two hours, maybe an hour and a half it took. Um, coming up with recipes and stuff like that, writing down everything I need, the list. That's why it takes time. So I'm probably, you should see the recipe I'm going to make. It's going to be delicious, I think. And I've been craving rice and tomato soup. Like, you know, like a simple, simple um, tomato rice soup. Like, um, it's just basically cooked rice with tomato juice. Like, <laughs> it's like salt and pepper. Oh, my, my, I had a babysitter or not. Yeah. I think it was a babysitter who used to make that. I'm never going to fully just give up rice. Like I'll cut down, but no, like my biryani. I didn't even have that much rice. There's so much. It's still in the fridge too. I, I feel bad because I don't know if I'm going to, maybe I'll see if Salah will eat it. I don't usually always eat the leftovers, but I'll be, but listen to this. Where did my husband go? Hey, we had, um, what was it? Okay. What I used to get for like, when I was like being naughty, I'm going camping again. No, I'm not ready. <laughs> yeah, actually. Yeah. If you make more barbecue, hun, I'll go. <laughs> so I used to go to the dollar, the Dollarama and get two chocolate bars. They were two for a dollar at the time. So usually two big Turks, a box of instant mashed potatoes, ravioli, <laughs> so gross. No, I mean, I, ravioli is good. I'm sorry. Just for barbecue, always thinking of the food, right? Well, I mean, it's not that pleasant sitting in the heat with bugs crawling up your friggin' short pants. <laughs> no, the fire too, babe. You're really good at, pretty good at, no, you're really good at making the fires. I didn't, I was worried about that. I've never met somebody who could make a fire in my life. Maybe my stepdad, that's about it. The camping looked romantic? Yeah, it really was, especially at night. Yeah. In the morning, the freaking rooster would wake you up and the heat, the heat. And twice I woke up because the CPAP cut off. But then the guy had the, um, you know, <laughs> strawberries and cream. Oh yeah, except swordfish who makes them, but not on purpose. Not grease fires. Yeah, I've seen plenty of those. <laughs> In the back alley shawarma friggin' factory. Missouri, what kind of food is there, Larry? I gotta do a tour of the States, but I need security. We, Salah and I, babe, I know you want to be the security, but we need security if we go around the States because I have a lot of haters there. There's someone with who wants to like shoot me and stuff. Oh, I can't even say that on YouTube anymore. <laughs> security is needed. I don't think they would. Yeah. Bring it on. Bring it on. We can rent a security team with. Oh my god! Like they do when if you visit Yemen, remember, babe? We're watching this vlog of this guy, this travel vlogger. This is what we aspire to do, like just travel around. But he does like danger traveling, even though the people look super nice in Yemen and I don't see any. There's unrest, there's political unrest in Europe. You have to have a security team when you travel to Yemen. So he has this guy who's like this tall. <laughs> it's like a really short Yemeni guy. His gun is as tall as he is and he follows this vlogger around with this huge we need one of those. <laughs> and listen, everyone is welcome here. We usually have a good time. Sometimes I go off. I aim not to, but it doesn't always work. Rarely ever works. I have faith someday I will learn to just, you know, gray stone. What's it called where you like gray rock, where you don't show any emotion? And uh, I'm nice to everybody. You're all welcome here. I give you a chance if you're nice to me and you, you know, that's fine. If you're not, I tell you to sit and spin sometimes. Sometimes I just ignore. And that's how we do. This is how we do it. Babe, what is your, your medal for Kung Fu again? Black belt? No. Triple medal? I can't remember. He has a picture. Did you show the Beezers that picture of you with all your medals? He showed me. That's hot. Paris Hilton. That's hot. I can't even do a Valley Girl voice. That's hot. <laughs> oh, there's nothing I hate in the world more than a Valley Girl voice. There's this girl I watch on TikTok and she drives me nuts. I hate to be mean, but... um. She has a lot of haters too, but anyways, I watch her. She does YouTube, she does TikTok battles and she got, recently got her lips done. And ever since she got her lips done, she now talks like a valley girl. Like, I don't know why it changed her voice, but it did. I look like the nun in the nun video. Thank you. I kind of want to try lip filler. 
actually. I'm not gonna lie. What is it gonna look like? <laughs> I don't know what I would look like, but it looks painful. How much does lip filler cost? And actually, yeah, whenever I put like, thanks Miss Leechy, this one is like really thin, but whenever I put the Too Faced Lip Plumper, it usually works, but it's not forever, you know? <laughs> I had you Dancha, AKA Black Belt, yes, babe. That's hot. A filler? It's so painful. You got one done, Sneaky Tea? It's expensive. How much expensive? I wouldn't mind getting lip filler, but I'm scared. It'll mess up the shape of my lips. Bumpy. Yeah. It hurts like a bee. You had it done, Becca? So they don't last forever? 700 Oh. To get your lips done, it's 700 I thought it was like $10,000. <laughs> or no, that's a boob job. <laughs> your husband would be upset. Yeah, I don't think so. Lot. Babe, would you want me to get my lips bigger? No. I don't. But my my brows just are naturally shaped like uh, check marks. And sometimes I pluck these stray hairs, but I haven't been. Filler parties? They buy it in bulk? No way! 190 pounds? Okay, that's not bad. Was it like Juvederm? Every six months, Kit Kat. Oh, wow. I lost a few appointments. Thanks, babe. But what about my top lip, babe? Potato. I wouldn't have a potato smile anymore. 7k to 10k. Yeah, I'm just afraid it like, you know, they're already not that uh, perky perk. And if I lose more, if I lose weight, I'm gonna need something probably. <laughs> Saggy skin. Oh, Nashville, Tennessee has the hot Nashville chicken. <laughs> thanks, babe. Thanks, Belle. Get a lip flip. How long does the lip flip last? And what do they do? They just flip your lip? Kuwait is the land of plastic surgery for the Gulf. How many dinars do you think a lip flip is? <laughs> so I would never let me get that. Right, babe? Lip flip is... <laughs> Garlic Neckbeard's newest clickbait video talks about getting cosmetic surgery in Nashies. <laughs> neckbeard. Remember I said Sam had a smelly neckbeard? You need a lift and implant, so probably like 15k. I think the Canadian government covers uh, a lift if you're, if they're really bothering you, like if they're like really, you know, the skin is bugging you, don't they? Or is that just a reduction if you're back, hurting your back? Yeah. No, the skin, maybe if you get skin infections or something. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think it would qualify at all. No. <laughs> The flips don't last long. Really, Samantha? Do they last a long time? And do they hurt? Zero chance cosmetic surgery is halal. Actually, April, I did look that up. And that's not true. It can be halal. Um, if it's medically necessary. It. Oh, yeah. So the cosmetic part. Yeah, it has to be like medically. Like it can improve your life medically. Or it depends on the situation, April. But yeah. I had a reduction. Didn't pay anything because I... I had bra strap marks and headaches that you can't prove anyway. Oh, really, Tina? Nice. Maybe they just take the woman's word for it. <laughs> I mean, how are you going to prove that? Yeah, headaches and back pain. Like, they do lip fillers to make them look bigger, and I think it costs between 80 to 120, Katie. Hmm. Would you ever let me get that done, babe? <laughs> I don't know. Doesn't it, like, come back weird looking? Like pubes? Nah, that's not that bad. That's affordable for the lip filler. I thought it was thousands. Assisted living in Ozempic ads. They put the needle in your lips. Yeah, ouch. It does. Elon's hair transplant. Yeah, I don't want to look like, uh, I don't want turkey hair. I kind of want to see what, I want a little bit, my top lip to be a bit fuller. But it's not really necessary, so. I don't know. They numb it? Okay, that's good. Ow, just the thought of them putting in your, oh, the lips have the most nerves, don't they? Yeah, I had a lip piercing. It was the most painful piercing of my life. Really bad. It was like here. See, I still have the scar. Oh. I'm pretty sure it ripped a bunch of hair too. <laughs> the numbing didn't help mine. I looked crazy after because they swell up huge. Yeah. But no need for you, babe, because I mentioned you are naturally beautiful. Mm. Thanks, babe, but you have to say that. <laughs> I know you mean it. Self-care era, mayhaps. But I don't know about plastic surgery. 
Maybe I should get lip filler and the, the fox eyes. Why do they do like this? This one is small. They have to elongate. They'll go, ma'am, you need your eye open. And then the lip filler. <laughs> rat face. Imagine rat face with lip injections. <laughs> Storm, no. <laughs> Maybe some wrinkle eraser here. I have one small wrinkle, see? What if you go like this? A mini lift? <laughs> what do they do, like lift your face? Girl, just focus on your inner health and beauty. Yeah, I need to work on my health, I guess. But, you know, cosmetic surgery is just so easy. It doesn't require exercise. I'm down 11 kgs from my highest weighing in Kuwait. I was 166. And, uh, yeah, so... Um, I gotta, like, you know... I gotta get those weights and start doing burpees. I don't know, now I kind of want lip filler. <laughs> Look when I smile, my top lip, babe, look, my top lip disappears. What's a burpee? Hold on, I'll show you what I mean, okay? okay. Ow! <laughs> I hurt myself on the treadmill. I have too many coffee tables. <laughs> oh! fish. So you take this weight and you go like this. Is this a burpee? This hurts your stomach if you, your core muscles and strengthens your back. Oh, this is six kgs. Oh, that felt good actually. Oh, that's not a burpee. That's a deadlift. What's, what's a burpee? <laughs> Don't work out in a jump up. I push up and a jump up. Never mind. I'm not doing burpees. Babe, we have too many coffee tables and too many couches. <laughs> oh, forget it. I'm not doing a burpee. Shoot your legs out and do a plank position. What? Oh, no. I can't do that. <laughs> I just ordered a new sofa. It will come tomorrow. Where are we going to put it? I guess we don't have a sofa in the kitchen. <sighs> this makes my head look really long when I do that. You didn't waste money. I do use it. I unplug it all the time. I mean, I haven't really been using it consistently, but I'm going to get back on it. But we, we can't plug the lamp and this at the same time. By the way. The problem is, like, if we go out, if we go out on a day where I'm doing a lot of walking... I don't bother going on the treadmill because I'm getting my walking in and I don't want to overdo it with my sciatica right away. Can I do push-ups? Yeah, but the ones where you're kneeling. <laughs> Babe, she's doing what I do with my arm. Nobody's mean to Pete's. No, there's a heart there. I think she was being sarcastic, Tracy. <laughs> I unhid you, Nikki. You know what, Tracy? I thought that too. I was like, I think she's a hater, but then I seen the heart. I think she's being sarcastic. <laughs> Stop abusing her by being giving her kisses. Yeah, she is super soft. Yeah, Tracy can block haters. So Sunday, we'll try to film a little bit to show you guys. Don't put your tail in your water dish. Where's the mods for these two trolls? Shake my head. What's going on? I, I didn't hear your mama be mean. Anyways, your mom is mean to everyone equally. <laughs> she's so docile she just lets me do whatever like kiss her grab her head <laughs> they're trolling you <sighs> okay cheese and crackers just change the subject i love her i love her still in a little heat you think so she normally acts very affectionate like this but she was in heat earlier today so she's probably just you know she's just more tired now um, I gave her extra food today too because she doesn't eat as much when she's in heat so I make sure to give her a lot of food and uh, whoa also she sleeps more <laughs> Sunday is your day babe are you ready we're gonna bring you to the vetty vets we're gonna miss you crazy frog yeah you haven't played in a while don't touch any other cats if she goes into heat tomorrow or Saturday I'm gonna lose it if that happens, she's having babies. <laughs> I'm sorry, but like, my God. 
Last time it took about 10 days. Tomorrow's Friday, Saturday. You just have to wait two days. We can't go near cats for two days, babe. <laughs> they can go any heat from that, from just smelling a male. It's not good. There's so many stray cats around here. <sighs> I hear wild dogs out there. I wanna go see them. No, I'm not seeing any animals. We have to stay away from all animals until she gets spayed. I'm flossing your teeth. <clears throat> I'm, at, I'm getting hungry. I'm getting peckish. The mustard stroke. No, what mustard stroke? I have a booger on my nose. You have a booger on my nose? I have a pimple here. I won't bust. I like your barbecue skills. Yeah, we like your barbecue skills. I have, like, why is this yellow? Jaundice, watch. If I had jaundice, wouldn't my eye whites be yellow? Let's use the filter. What the heck? Oh yeah, ceiling. Who likes to seal? <laughs> so those cheek pinches are so sweet. Oh. They are. You found the power bank? Oh no, is there a mark? <laughs> uh, the lights went out, see? Because we have to plug things, other things in now. Whoa! Your neighbor says yellow. Are my eyes still different shapes? Yeah. I'm an English uh, major dropout. Oh. Yeah, I dropped out of university. I think that makes sense. Yeah. Under my chin. Ah. Oops. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna keep it like this. Cause it kept going up. Mm. <laughs> the Johnny. Chubby face. It's hard to deal with. Ceiling? Yeah. Are you ceiling? I'm ceiling. But you're looking at the ceiling. Yeah. How come? Oh. Yeah. See how guys have the. There's lighting around the ceiling here, but I think connecting. Oh. Maybe it's only uh, in the corners. Yeah. <laughs> That's weird. Hmm. I gotta reach up there and dust up there. Jeez. The central AC. Yeah. <laughs> Dusty. Bay. You hungry, Bay? Yeah. <laughs> I could snack. We only had one meal today, didn't we? Yeah, only one meal. At like uh, Which is eleven, at like noon. So I haven't eaten in eleven hours. I had a small snack, a bag of chips. So you're counting the calories? Yeah. Pudi admits she doesn't dust the apartment. You guys know exactly what they're gonna say, right? Hey, Laurel. And I think you missed the uh, insulin. Oh yeah, I gotta take my insulin, bees. Yeah, soon. Tried wife sourdough. No, I'm not a tried wife who does sourdough starters. I have trypophobia. We don't know about mitzvah songs. <laughs> Unfortunately. Is that the celebration where they step on a wine glass? Yeah, Caroline, I saw that. Yeah. That's how it goes. I told you it's projection 101. That's why. And then tomorrow you're going to buy me stuff. Inshallah shopping. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I get the look you gave. <laughs> like what? <laughs> you didn't know that I was planning on going shopping. <laughs> Window shopping. <laughs> you just look at everything and don't buy. <laughs> yeah, babe, it's a thing. People do that, you know. It's called window shopping. You just look at the stuff. I need a new mascara. Oh, a 
fun is to get your teeth clean. Don't be mo. Oh, get your teeth clean. Good for you. That's so cool. Your breath won't smell. Give lots of licks and sniff lots of crotches. <laughs> I gotta check Julia's teeth, actually. We might have to clean her teeth at Pet Zone. Anyways. Okay, babe, we have to, uh, bees. You and me, bees. How about my teeth? <laughs> yeah. I'm next. I gotta go to Turkey. I didn't sleep good this morning. Well, our neighbors hate us. The cat and heat, the keyboard at three. <laughs> three, it's the cat. Yeah, it's still... I don't know if there's a legal like, time for noise. In Canada, babe, after 11 p.m., you have to be quiet or people can call the cops on you. What? It's not like that here, eh? Mm. I remember the dishwasher was like my chore I used to get for like a $5 allowance. <laughs> and I used to use it on chicken burgers at school. <sighs> I had a friend who uh, stole, I told you guys that. She used to like hoard chicken burgers and Miracle Whip packets and sell them. They... Your snack is outside. Where? I'll go get it. When you watch the movie, right? Mm -hmm. What are we gonna have? Uh, no popcorn because you, yeah. you had it already. Yeah. <laughs> no popcorn because you had it already. Um, you finished the whole uh, bit? No, I didn't! <laughs> I'm just joking. No, I left all the crappy flavors for <laughs> I left all the plain flavors, the multi-green sun chip things I don't like, the spicy flavor chips, mm. <laughs> the shade. Yeah, I don't want chips and popcorn anyways. And I'm not throwing any shade. <laughs> <laughs> I'm throwing the shade. <laughs> Bae. Would you be annoyed if you had somebody always bugging you for food? Bae. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Yeah, but babe, I only ate once today. Don't have any. Okay. I don't want to say what dinner was. Actually, I didn't have dinner. We had an early... We ate at like noon. For real, I swear. And then I had, yeah, just a few snacks. <laughs> it's true. I was just snacking on a couple chips. Maybe uh, just end the meat? No. Why not? <laughs> what? What? You need the pizza now. No, no, no. <laughs> if I was a wolf, I would look like this. We don't have any cheese slices left, and we only have what? one indomie. You them all? <laughs> no, but over a period of like a month. Why are you even asking? You like queen pizza? <laughs> oh my god! Chinese food bees and oh, it's too heavy. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. <laughs> yeah, it's late for Chinese. Ni hao, babe. Ni hao. Xie xie. Xie xie. Thank you. <laughs> Kung Pao Chicken Shishi. <laughs> <laughs> What's that Chinese place I always ate at in Ottawa? Uh, can you uh, block uh, Bill? Why? She put, uh, hamburger? <laughs> yeah, no, not burger. Uh, <laughs> no, Bell is immune to all blocking. <laughs> <laughs> we have some burgers in the freezer, but they're like, I don't like those ones, do you? The Sierra burgers? You see them? Sierra. Oh, Sierra. Chicken. They taste like um, drywall. No. No, not the chicken. It's the beef ones. The beef ones? Yeah, they have hard things. Oh, it was Chinese restaurant ink. <laughs> Cheese sticks. <laughs> no. Oh. But they were good, Anna. A 24-hour stream? Oh, heck no. Heck yeah. You would? Lies. What's the uh, Thanksgiving what the... about? It's or a beans? holiday that means um what's the history of it? I think it's celeb I think it's like you know, whenever like Christopher Columbus came to America and oh, stole it from the Indians. When he, when he discovered the USA? Yeah, but he stole it from the Indians in a bloody massacre. Mm. Yeah. 
the aboriginals. So Christopher Columbus is kind of a piece of crap. I'm just joking. <laughs> no, well, yeah, I mean, you know, people say that. But yeah, it celebrates being thank. Basically, what my family and I do, we don't think about the like the history really. We kind of just like celebrate being thankful for what we have. So before we eat, we go around the table and say what we're thankful for, and then we cheers. I usually have a glass of Clamato juice. It's not about Columbus. It's about the first settlers in America. Oh yeah. Did you ever did uh, 24 hours uh, live stream before? Did hours? I? Even 12? I don't know. I thought I did a 24 hour one before, but I don't think so. When you were sleeping with the CFA? Yeah, I did. I slept. I did a sleep stream. <laughs> and you was uh, muted or not? No. But I probably would now if I did that. Yeah. I'm not sleeping with a hijab on. I mean that time. Yeah. I didn't mute. No, that's not the funniest part. <laughs> if I talk in my sleep or something, you know. <laughs> Do you guys remember when I did that? Were you there for that? Wasn't it Christopher Columbus? I don't know. Columbus Day. Or I don't know. Who's the guy that had those three boats? The Santa Maria. Ah. They changed it to Indigenous People Day. Oh, good. The first settlers got along with the Native people. Oh, the bounty of the harvest with the new, yeah. Yeah, but something went horribly wrong, didn't it? Day in my life. <laughs> just sealing. Imagine it's like just me sealing with a time lapse. <laughs> no way. <laughs> oh, Christopher Columbus has nothing to do with Thanksgiving. I was wrong. Al-Anam turkey breast. <laughs> They're looking up when turkeys are on sale in Kuwait. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna die. That is so funny. The reaching. Jesus. Out of control. <laughs> the obsession. I can't believe it. Al Anam turkey? Okay, thank you. I'll check it out. Or I might just make maybe I maybe I can make a big chicken. It's the same thing. So maybe uh, I guess nobody knows what's uh, Thanksgiving here? Yeah. It's American Thank Canadian Thanksgiving was in October. And American Thanksgiving is on November 20th, so maybe okay, I can... you know the dates, but what's about? I don't understand. Probably. Being thankful for the harvest, for food, for oh, having okay. a lot of stuff. Uh -huh. Food, yeah. So... I mean in general, nothing yeah. in specific. We have a huge meal. We make a specific a traditional meal. Mm -hmm. Usually a big bird, like a turkey, or whatever. I mean Thanksgiving for God, right? No. For it's country? not a holy... Co yeah, for the country. Yeah. The, for the history of the country, like with the early settlers that came to America mm -hmm. and um, for the food and everything. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> the cornucopia. Yeah, the horn of plenty. The first settlers were immigrants from Europe to America. They were thankful that the Native Americans welcomed them and gave them food. Oh, I didn't even know that. Oh, okay. Thank yeah, you. cool. Thank you for, more, uh, again, uh, for the information, make it more clear. Yeah. And then after they were thankful, they mm -hmm. killed all the Indians and stole their land. Oh. Yeah. What it's true, isn't it? I mean, that's not noise. That's not noise. No, it's not. They gave them blankets with smallpox. So horrible. Mayans who sacrifice people in a temple. What? Oh yes, it, it, Aboriginals. Like yeah, you're right. I used to get. I had my mom was really good friends with a, a Native American. And I, she used to babysit me. It was wild on the reserve. No rules. <laughs> it was fun, though. But yeah, the reserve was... Could have been a lot better. Better treatment. I think it's more more uh, for uh, a tradition things. Yes, we'll traditional, yeah. Out, right? and, yeah. You know, having, having a food together, eat together. Yes. Yeah. Gathering and sharing the happiness. Yeah, and food. We have a specific traditional meal that maybe I can make on Thanksgiving. <laughs> Poutine? No. <laughs> It's um, a roast turkey, but if we can't find turkey, a chicken. Mm -hmm. Stuffing, which is made with like spices and bread and stuff. And you put it inside the chicken. Kind of like the stuffed pigeons, but you oh, stuff a chicken, yeah. yeah. I know. Mashed potatoes, gravy, cranberry sauce, and meat pie. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. Did I say gravy? Yes. Antenna. <laughs> Anyways! Well, I thought, I thought the number of viewers said 627. Oh, nobody likes me. <laughs> over quantity. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh yeah, I know. What? Ch Chantal Educational Corner is much like drunk history. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the green bean casserole. Yeah, they never made that in my family. I missed out. I think, I don't know if you're going to like Canadian food. <laughs> yeah, you do when I make it for you. Chantal. Yeah, we have to react. You should. We should do Thanksgiving and have him try it and react to it. Bread dressing, yeah. Stove top. It's best ever. My baby, my baby. Aw. Babe, she's getting an operation. Yes, she is. Really, Wolf Pup? Can you hear it? Someone flushing? No. What? There's something in the water. In the inside the pipes. Yeah, someone uh, flushing the toilet. <laughs> That's what it was. No. <laughs> it's here. It's in our house. Oh no. The ghost had to use the washroom. <laughs> Make sure you use that the bidet. <laughs> Spray with the, the sprayer freshener. <clears throat> Somebody say uh, in the chat, Thanksgiving is dumb. Is dumb? Why is dumb? I don't know. No, Pam, she's still here, but she's going to be going to the vet on Sunday. Turducken. By the way, uh, the gravy? did they eat uh, kangaroos? I think that they do, eh, in Australia? Hey, Chewy's mom! Sometimes you sometimes you just go into your house, and sometimes there's a random koala bear in your house. Mm -hmm. In Australia. That would be so cool. No, I trigger people. Aww. Oh, A, B, C, D. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>